Quick video on how to completely remove all the information off of your iPad. So if you're going to go ahead and sell your iPad, return it, give it to somebody else, and you want none of your information on it, including emails, photos, videos, any private information that you had stored in your iPad, this will completely delete all of it. So first thing you wanna do is go into your settings, and then right at the top, you'll see your iCloud account. If you have signed into your iCloud account, you need to click on that, and then at the bottom, it'll say sign out of iCloud account. It's gonna ask you to enter in your password for your iCloud, so your Apple ID password, you're gonna to need to do that. You have to sign out to delete everything off of this. So make sure you've signed out and do that right now. And then once you've done that, then you're gonna go in, here we'll go back to this beginning step right here. So you're gonna go settings, you're gonna go general, and then you're going to scroll right down to transfer or reset. So we'll click on that one. And then there's a reset or erase all content and settings. Reset will just reset like your Wi-Fi signal and stuff. It's not gonna remove anything. Erase all content and settings is the one you need to select. So we're gonna go ahead and select that one right there. And it's gonna give you some warnings that it's gonna erase your iPad. You can remove everything off of it. Do you want it to continue? Yes, we do want to continue. So you're gonna press the continue button. It's gonna warn you again. Are you sure you want to erase all media, content and settings? This cannot be undone. So you have to make sure you've backed up or saved any information that you want on the iPad because it's gonna be all removed. Yes, as long as you're 100% certain, just click the erase iPad right there and then it's gonna ask for your passcode if you have a passcode on here. So I'm gonna enter in my passcode. I've done my passcode and as soon as I've entered it in, you can see it starts the reset process and depending on how much information you have in your iPad will determine how long it's gonna take. This iPad was previously wiped so it's not gonna take a lot of time but you'll probably see this icon going slower if you have a lot of information on your iPad. And that's it, once it's done and it's rebooted back up, then you are all 100% good to go. You can give this iPad away, you can return it, you can do whatever you need to do.